for it. And we don't want to do it. We don't want to do it. Any Ebola outbreak is a very threatening situation in any country. But fortunately, this is a country that has experience in managing Ebola outbreaks in the past. There is a lot of capacity available at the national level, locally. And just from this brief visit, I've seen how the response has been intensified and is being scaled up by the government, working very closely with partners, development partners, including WHO, and also, importantly, with communities. So here we're visiting a treatment center that is being established. What I very much appreciate about it is that it's a treatment center that's going to be in the community. As we can see, community members are very much engaged in being part of the work of constructing this facility, meaning we've learned a lot. We've learned from other outbreaks that if you have these treatment facilities which are closed off, which look suspicious, these are the places that people get frightened about, where people start to attack them. And so this new way of providing this facility is going to be for us a very, I found, a very interesting way to learn. We are, of course, aware that um, an outbreak like this, which has reached the capital city, is a very demanding situation in terms of the response that is needed because that is where the risk exists of people moving from uh, an urban area like Kampala going to other districts and that area itself is, is people are living in very close proximity the risk is high. I'm very encouraged by the determined way in which the government is tackling the situation and also very appreciative of the way the partners both the UN bilateral partners and technical partners have come together to sub give a strong support to this. And as WHO, we're very committed to working with all our partners to adapt our response, to scale up, and most importantly, to appeal to the international community for the resources, the financial resources that are needed to keep moving with this response to this Ebola outbreak in Uganda.